Hey, what's up guys? Today I'll be doing game 651 of the Road to 384, so here we go. Alright, instantly thinking Oklahoma or Texas looking at this. Oh, never mind. Florence, Alabama. Okay, now that I turn around and see the hills, I can see that. So we got Crown Street and Woodward. Or what does that say? Woodard. Interesting name. Um, let me go east on Woodard. See if that gets us to a main road. Great to see that uh, their trash cans were helpful, though. Let's get out to the main road here. And let's keep going north because Florence is south of Muscle Shoals, which is another main town in the MSA. We got Huntsville Road, and this is Cox Creek Parkway. All right, so let's go ahead and find that. Oh, I actually had it mixed up. Never mind. Um, here's the parkway. Where's Huntsville at? Is it this one here? Nope. Oh, does it keep going down here? Yeah, it does. Oh, there's Huntsville. Okay, so there's Woodard and Crown. Alright, and we're right by the second house here. And there we go, two yards away in the Florence area. Alright, on to round two. Uh, that's a nice Massachusetts plate right there. So yeah, definitely in Massachusetts. Most likely Boston, as always. Uh, we got Pine Tree Lane. Let's keep going east. Uh, this could be one of those uh, Exer Browns in Massachusetts. Those tend to happen quite often. Alright, so it's revealed that this is Hill Street, and I might as well actually no, I won't. Since the L dash went away, won't keep going on that street. Um, we don't have a name for this one yet. Hopefully that changes soon. Alright, here we go. Oh, so this one's also Hill Street, okay. And yeah, let's keep going east. Oh, this is US 44, so you know what? We're actually over by Providence. I guess there's a chance it could be the Boston area, depending on where we're at. But most likely it'll be Providence. So is this Raynham place a town? Saw a few signs for that. Not seeing a anywhere named Rain or er, uh, Raynham. It's Cape Highway. It's probably that way the whole way through. Wouldn't surprise me. But yeah, U.S. Highway 44, definitely one of the more or lesser known uh, highways. That's for sure. Okay, and there we go. We're entering Taunton, so we are in the Providence area. So we're back here somewhere. Gotta find Hill Street, wherever it might be. Probably missed it. Let's see. So do we have all the car dealerships and stuff here? Can't tell. All right, let's just keep going. Man, that's a hill road. Really trying to mess us up here. So I definitely missed it. Are we much closer than I thought? I mean, we're going east. So I don't know what's going on. That's none of these roads. 
All right, you know what? I'm going to go back to the start and go west because it looked like there's some stuff over here too. So this is also Hill Street. Pine Hill Estates. It said we were entering Taunted, so very confused on what we we're seeing. So definitely, okay, so we're over here. So why did it say, must have been for the other side. Okay, whatever. We were by Pine Tree Lane when we started. Had like three houses. Yeah. There we go, 21 yards away. And that is in the Providence area. All right, round three. We got Marigold. And let's see what the name of this one is. As if I can. Juno. And Hillsborough County. Okay, so we're over by Tampa Bay. Uh, let's go east. Now we got North Lois. Let's head south. Alright, now it's being really slow on me. Alright, there we go. Maybe. Uh, it's just going to be one of those rounds. Okay, anyways. Here we go. West Bird Street. Alright, let's try going east here. Some of these suburban developments can be kind of hard to navigate. Now we got Grady. Another dead end? Alright, let's just try going north. Okay, and now there's this main road I had no idea was here. Um, and this is West Waters Avenue. Wonder if we're close to Highway 75. That would not surprise me. Del Mabry. Alright, you know what? Let's try to find this. So we got all the signs suggesting we're in Hillsborough County. So this shouldn't be too hard to find. Let's see. We're on Waters, which is over here. Is this 580, the Dale Mabry Highway? It sure is. And so we're over here. Let's go back to the start. It's Marigold and Bird, I believe. Juno. Okay, glad I checked. So, let's see. There's Juno, and there's Marigold. Alright, there we go. One yard away. Right in the suburbs of Tampa. Alright, round four. We got, like, some leaf blocking the camera here. <coughs> um, I could see this being southern. Got Marabou and Bowfin. Let's try to catch some plates. Is that a Delaware plate? I think it might be. And as I keep asking every time, will this round once again contribute to Philadelphia or will Delaware finally have a round for its own? Probably the first, but you never know. Could be Dover. Alright, where are the street signs? Maybe this is just the same road. Alright, now it's Marlin Drive and it's Glasgow. Alright, well, we got a highway right here, so let's actually head on that. And we got Business 896 over here. And I'd have to assume this is a state highway as well. Unless if it's uh, Highway 13. Not seeing anything on that, though. Don't like those three-digit numbers, though. That means they probably aren't that long. Good to know for sure, though, that we're in Delaware, though. And yeah, we got one of these signs, too. So more Delaware meta, if you haven't picked up on that yet. Um, maybe there's a sign back here saying what this highway is. Oh, this is 896. Hold on. So is 896 like a big highway? Well, there's Glasgow over there. This must be where we're at. Glasgow 
Glasgow Avenue. Yeah, this is where we're at. Okay, so, yep, as I said earlier, this will once again indeed be around for Philadelphia and not Dover. All right, there we go. Three yards away in the Delaware suburbs of Philadelphia. Just wait. One of these rounds will have a Maryland round for Philadelphia. That'll be crazy. All right, round five. Uh, this is looking like Texas, probably in the Rio Grande Valley. That'll be my guess, at least. I could see this being the Inland Empire, too, potentially. Um, okay, no street signs. So let's actually try going south. And it's another dead end. All right. Let's go east, then. All right, we got County Road 73, and yep, we have front plates, so probably Texas. And this one was Ballard. Let's see, with this County Road 73. Oh, what does this say? Absolute Industries. Um, let's try going north. It doesn't look like there's much to the south. Whoa. Where'd we go? Okay, so we're just cutting to the east here. Environmentally sensitive area. Nooses County. That is one I'm not familiar with. I know McAllen's Hidalgo County. I'm not sure what Brownsville is, though. It's very uh, odd-looking area, though. You got, like, some of the houses built on stilts, so we've got to be by the coast. So this probably is just Brownsville. Um, because the houses like that are to prevent flooding when hurricanes happen. You see them all the time in Louisiana by the bayou and stuff. So, it's probably where we're at right now. Fortunately, though, I really have nothing to go off of. We're going to, like, circles, too. I don't know if this is even the right way to go or not. But it's got to be Texas, just like I said, based on the plates I'm seeing, all of that, all signs are pointing to Texas. Alright, will this road finally straighten out? No, it's not. So this is going to be interesting to try to find on the map, because this is all brand new to me. I have no idea where we're at. And now we're put in Gen 1. Wonderful. Alright, so I'm going to go back to the start, and I'm going to go south instead, because clearly north was not the way to go. Unfortunately, I don't know Nooses County. Don't even know if that's the proper way to say it, so... Yeah, there's that. And I guess there actually was stuff to the south, so I was wrong. Alright, let's keep going south. Alright, now it's starting to look a bit more developed. Let's see. Got a light up here. That's huge. And I went right past it. Come on. Just let me see what we got. Alright, Northwest Boulevard, and that is a big address number. Um, Now which way do I want to go? I'll try going east. Yeah, this is all brand new to me. I don't recognize any of this. And if it's McAllen or Brownsville, well, it can't be McAllen because it's not Hidalgo County. It's a place I haven't been to before. And if, if it's a metro I've been to before, not this area. I'll tell you that much. Um, What area code do we have? 361, okay, so it's not one of the Texas area codes that I know. Um, okay, there's a lot of stuff here, though, so we're actually finding something. That's a highway down there, so that'll be huge. We're on an FM road. Just saw a sign there, but really doesn't matter. Looking, it's a four-digit number. Not worth your time looking for that. And here we go, 37 and 69, so I guess we're by Corpus Christi. Okay. Yeah, this is where you've got to be. 
There it is. All right. So yeah. And now we just got to find County Road 73, wherever it is. Oh, it's got to be this up here. So yeah, that's what it does. It goes up along the river. That's why it's winding like that. Here's Ballard, and then we were on this part of the road. And yeah, let's see. So road's right there, so we're right in between these two. And there we go, one yard away. Well worth it after all that right in the outskirts of Corpus Christi. All right, there we go. Round one was Florence, Alabama. Round two was Providence. Round three was Tampa Bay. Round four is Philadelphia. And round five was Corpus Christi. All right, so we are in Florence for the fourth time. Okay, a lot of threes and fours in Alabama. And then round two was Providence, and that is the 64th time there. And then round three was Tampa Bay, and that is the 58th time there. And then round four was Philadelphia, that's the 62nd time there. And then to finish it off, round five was down in Corpus Christi, and that is the 8th time there. And with that, I'll complete game 651. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you next time.